Hey guys, what's going on? Expose Bruss here. Welcome back to the channel. So I've wanted to make this video for a very long time, but I kept putting it off because I kept telling myself that maybe shotgun raids would change. Maybe he would stop making shitty clickbaity content, which he steals from smaller YouTubers and uploading it as his own just for the sole purpose of getting views and in turn money from other people's content. But no, he actually doubled down on what he did to me and many other creators by con number one, continuing to do it, and number two, by removing me from the description after I called him out on Twitter. Today, we're going to be talking about Shotgun Raids. Shotgun Raids is a Minecraft Hypixel Bedwars YouTuber, most known for his incredibly clickbait content, his incredibly, you know, uniform and boring intros. I'm just gonna play a little bit, a little bit, a few of these intros really quickly so you can tell um, exactly how uniform and boring these are. So just, just, just listen to this for one second. They're, they all sound the exact same. All right, so I asked a lot of mods what the worst is. Yo, 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 so there was a... All right, so cheap break up. Yo, 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 so, so they've been so I asked a lot. Yo, 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 Yeah, so as you can see, most of his intros are incredibly repetitive. He always goes, yo, 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 guys, in the hub. And on the videos where he's not doing that, he actually plays the same song, the same background music, and it kind of goes like this. I'm going to play it really quickly for a second. For the comparison's sake, go away, shit are you just... The this, go, 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 go. So I told him to bridge as much as he can, and he's uh, really difficult to do. And again, okay. We were trying to do disappear, disappear. And <laughs> literally every kill he gets is either insanely suspicious. So he plays that background music at the beginning of almost every single video where he's not in the lobby going, "Yo, yo, yo, guys, yo." yo. So like he's uh, every single video, every single video. And just to illustrate how repetitive his content is, my friend Original Ace made a parody of his content. And by the way, I did ask him for permission. I'll put a screenshot of that on the screen right now, so you can't get me on that, buddy. Uh, uh, I, I did ask him for permission so I could include a clip of his video in my video, and he said yes. So here is his video, and as you can see, it just completely destroys shotgun raids and exposes how repetitive his content is. Oh my god, look at him! This dude's insane! This guy is the fastest bridger I've ever seen! <laughs> what is he drinking? Is that speed 2? Oh my god! No way guys, look at that! Get the bed, get the bed! Where did he go? Like, I literally can't see him anywhere. There he is! Oh my god! Guys, that's insane! He speed bridged all the way to mid. Oh my god, he's gonna die! Wait, how did you not take fall damage? Are you hacking? <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. This guy's literally amazing. <laughs> Yo, yo, yo. Okay, so last video, a bunch of you were telling me that he's hacking. Like, I literally don't know what you're talking about. Like, why would you think that? You sent me his mouse cam, like, he couldn't be cheating. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Incredibly repetitive, incredibly boring, and I... And I'm really sick of it, but that's not really why we're here. We're not here really to bash on his content like that too much. We're here to expose him for stealing other creators' content and claiming it as his own. Now, this happened to me, and it also happened to several other creators. Now, I recorded a video when this first happened a long time ago, and I'm also going to share some Discord messages I have with, have, have with Shotgun Raids, which prove that he claims my content as his own. And also, I'd like to talk about him removing me from his description after I called him out on Twitter for being a scumbag and trying to steal my content. Now, at the beginning, I do also mention him promoting hacked clients. And yeah, so just, just watch the video. You're un you'll understand. And I'm also going to do a side-by-side -side comparison after the video. So you guys can see that he almost copied my video word for word. But without further ado, here's the video of him completely copying my content and without my permission, and did not put me in the description until I asked him to. Uh, hey everyone, Tenny here, welcome back to the channel. So today's video is going to be about shotgun raids. Now, I really didn't want to make this video, I really didn't. I, I don't think 
that uh, I should be beefing with anyone, especially someone of this size. But it really bothers me when my content is just so blatantly stolen. It, it could have been just like plastered across the uh, sky. Tenebris, your content was stolen just above above the earth, like for everyone to see. It's extremely obvious. Anyway, yeah, if you're a Shotgun Raids fan watching this video, just know that your favorite creator just rips off smaller creators and just blasts EDM music in the background and uh, then just like talks about gameplay for the rest of the video after talking about the, the actual topic for the first like two minutes of the video. Anyway, so where did this start? We got uh, a tweet that I made from March 12th, 2018 where I said, wow, at Hypixel, why did you give YouTube rank to this guy who's promoting hacked clients? And basically, here's a video of Shotgun Raids hacking and then him having YouTuber rank and then it, it's saying, content focused on cheating or hacking the game or which supports cheating in any way. So basically, I was calling him out on that and he definitely did see this because he was tagged a few times down here all right, so right there, yeah, he was tagged by someone. So he probably saw this, not gonna lie, because uh, it was a pretty popular tweet as well. But ever since then, he's pretty much been, like, ripping off my videos. I'm not even kidding. Like, what's... Like, he's just com been completely ripping them off. But before we get into that, uh, I'd like to just show you this. So look at this title. There is a 0.09025% chance for this to happen in Bedwars, and it happened. Okay. And then there's this other guy named Cad7, who's a very small creator who has 7,000 subs. And his title is, there is a 0.050265% chance for this to happen in Skywars, and it happened. Okay? And now, luckily for this dude, Shotgun Raids actually linked him in the description and mentioned him a little bit in his video. I got a little bit of inspiration from this for another small YouTuber called Cad. I'll leave a link to him down below. He okay, so he got an inspiration for this video from CAD, right? These are the titles, right? So my question to Shotgun Raids is, uh, why would you upload a video called I found a Breezley Bridge mod for Bedwars one day after I made my Breezley Bridge mod is total bullshit video and then upload proof God bridging is possible in Bedwars with hand cam about, I don't know, uh, a few weeks after I upload my moonwalking is still impossible and is it possible to God bridge legit video, which I don't have right now, but you guys know that video. Um, and after it gets a lot of views, then you decide to just, like, copy it and upload your own version of it. But, uh, yeah, I'm not saying that I own bridging videos. I'm just saying a lot of the arguments he made in this video are exactly the arguments I made in my video. And there's no link, no link whatsoever to my channel in his description. There's nothing in the comments section. There's nothing anywhere. He's just taking my video, reinterpreting it, and then just, like, posting it. It's not original whatsoever, so we're, we're just gonna watch this really quickly. And in this game, because that's the whole purpose of playing duos, I guess. So what I always talk about is this mod. So essentially, the thing about this is it says it doesn't have an auto clicker in it, but then on top of that, it says it gives you a lot of CPS. So I don't know how people fall for this. It's like Okay, so basically, he's trying to make the point that it, it says it doesn't have an auto clicker, uh, but then it gets a lot of CPS, which is the exact point I said here. This, I, like, I'm not hacking, but it's a- He's not hacking, guys. He's not hacking. It's not a hack, okay? It's not a hack. It's just a mod. There's so many things wrong with this. Like, just just, just listen to this. Mod, I discovered that gives you a very big advantage. Okay, so it's not a hack, but it's a mod that gives you a very big advantage. Okay, so he basically just took exactly what I said in this video and then put it in his video without giving me any credit whatsoever. But then it gets a little bit worse than that. Watch this, guys. Let me try to find the, um, the part. Bye. Therefore, it actually works out. So if you're spawning left and right and you're being slowed down, it means that this guy's not going to come out and fight me. So I shall go in and fight you instead. Thank you. And because you're spawning left and right, it means you're going slower. Therefore, it's easier to bridge. Okay, so he just said because it's going left and right, it's going slower. So therefore, it's easier to bridge. If you're going completely backwards like this, it means you're practically god bridging. Okay, so let's watch this video. Point. Uh, 117 blocks or something like that. It was it was less than the the normal uh, speed that you walk back at Because as I said previously the slower you go the more blocks you can go um, Another thing that people need to understand. Okay, so that was a very obvious ripoff of my video It was completely like pretty much word for word Like I said it was slower and he basically said you can't do it because it goes you can do it because it goes slower all right, I'd like to just uh, show this part of my video. So this is just another, you know, example of uh, of of me saying that because you go slower, you can bridge more. So just listen to this. 
This is because um, if you see on the bottom right, my movement is actually changing really rapidly and it's slower. And you know, when I put in the calculation for how far you could go back with, sorry, but like with the, um, when I put in the calculation for how far you could go back with moonwalking, it was using like a higher number than I was getting when moving side to side there. Um, now, yeah, so I just like to clarify a few things before I finish this video because I know a lot of people are going to misinterpret this. Number one, I have nothing against shotgun raids. If he wants to DM me and work this out, go. he can go ahead. Um, I just at least want credit for my content that he blatantly stole. Um, if, he was, he, if he's going to go out and claim that he didn't steal my content, I find that extremely hard to believe considering I'm the only person on this platform making the points that he made in his video. I mean, Drock, of course, made the original It's Impossible to Moonwalk video, but he didn't mention anything about speed or anything like that. Only my video mentioned speed. And then he just completely like took it. But I mean, like it doesn't really make any sense. And also considering that I uploaded this video on March 30th, 2018, he uploaded his video a day later. Uh, I think this is pretty shady and I think he's just trying to get back at me for posting this. But yeah, hopefully this is just a misunderstanding and I'm not actually uh, onto something here. But yeah, if Shotgun Rids wants to like contact me, that would be fine. But other than that, guys, uh, don't go send hate to him. Hopefully uh, Shotgun Rids, uh, you know, Either, you know, links be in the description or something else because I don't really see any other explanations. So, hope everyone enjoyed this video. Bye-bye. Alright, everyone. So, I'm just going to be showing you guys these DMs, like, straight up. Like, just straight up. You know, this is his Discord. Um, as you can see, it's the same tag and everything. So, and mutual friends are, you know, known YouTubers. So, anyway, I'm just going to be putting up these DMs for everyone to see in this video so you guys can kind of see exactly... What, t what type of person this guy is and how he kind of claimed, you know, my, my content as his own. But right here is when he saw that I uploaded that video that you just saw a second ago unlisted to my channel. So he says, hello, caller type, because he really wanted to talk to me. And we talked and call for a little bit. And we talked about how he claims that he didn't actually steal my content. Now, I know that that's not true, but I kind of just went along with it because, you know, he's the bigger creator and I didn't really want to stand up for myself exactly right there. But I am now. So, you know, whatever. But pretty much um, if you scroll down, he says, uh, yo, I did a video. By the way, this is after he stole my bridging video. He asks me to steal another one of my video and um, videos and you know, I kind of regret this. Now, let, let me explain. I did give him permission for this particular one, but things down the line, I did not. So let me explain this. So he says, yo, I did a video about my old hacking videos when I was just trolling, just explaining it. I'm going to use your title slash thumb for it. So do I link your vid or channel for credit? And I said, video and channel. Link me when it's up. He's like, KK, two minute. This is the guy's Discord. If you want to get in contact with him too, I'll add him. Still hasn't replied. Change your Discord name just in case. By the way, I got the six series six series idea i think i i think i think could go viral on hypixel so as you can see he's all he basically only cares about the views it's very obvious and as a youtuber it's fine if you care about views i mean like i care about views most youtubers care somewhat about views you have to care about views somewhat but it's bad if you care entirely about the views and you don't care about your content at all because it's very clear right now that he's saying that, oh, I can make something that goes viral on Hypixel. So our, his idea was that we're going to screen share bridgers and stuff. This is the bridge we're going to screen share. That's relevant to this whole conversation. But anyway, this video up here, okay, he literally says right here, I'm going to use your title thumb for it. Do, so do I link your vid, right? But this is after I accused him of stealing my videos, right? And right here, it becomes this video. So we're going to click on this video really quickly. Okay, so Bedwars YouTuber accidentally exposes himself. All right, so video idea helps sub to him to my channel, uh, my my video and stuff, right? So it might be like, you might be like, oh yeah, this is fine, this is fine, right? I said, thanks for the shout out, dude. 260 upvotes, right? Now, this was published on April 7th, 2018. Now, if you open this up and go to Social Blade and look at April 7th, 2018, I actually can't go back that far, so I have to go to the daily sub. So April 7th, Let's see how many subscribers I gained from that shout out. Let's just see really quickly. Um, April 7th. 58 subs and 23 the next day, 39 the next day, 36 the next day. So it's very clear to me 
that this shout out didn't really do anything to my channel, right? Because obviously if he's going to steal my content, I do want some subscriber boost from that. Now, I don't care entirely about the sub count, but I think it's cool, right? You know, like if you're going to steal my content, if you're going to take my content, you're going to ask me to take your, take my content. I should be the primary beneficiary of that exchange. However, I'm not. I only got 30 subs, you know, 40 subs the next day. And I think it's really unfair for him to just take my content, make money off of it, and then quote unquote credit me in the description but i don't get any any anything for that i just get a credit with credit which doesn't even doesn't even give me anything more than um than what i should be getting right like it's like my sub count was like pretty like stable my daily subs was pretty stable like that was a normal day for me there was nothing actually like greater than normal there anyway so we're going to continue on the dms all right, so back on the DMs, if you scroll down a little farther, um, I said, yo, dude, I'm going to make a video about how mouse cam doesn't prove anything, right? And obviously, because this is because this is April 12th, when he, uh, you know, made that video saying, God bridging legit. And we're going to talk about that a little uh, later, um, about how he kind of promotes cheating in that way and kind of talking about that a little bit more in depth. But um, uh, anyway, so I asked him, like, you know, I'm going to make a video about how mouse cam doesn't prove anything because he made that video about mouse cams and you know someone god bridging with mouse cam which is kind of like original aces parody i guess you could say um but it, it, it's very clear to me that i just want to say one more thing about the last thing the social blade thing and stuff it's very clear to me that even if he credits me in the description he's not actually giving me full credit for the idea so i think that he should at least you know talk i mean he did say mention me in the video a little bit but he should definitely you know have a big like sign on the video saying this video was stolen from tenebris like i asked tenebris for this content and not just upload it like he's acting like pretty much he's like it's his own like a lot of a lot of people are going to watch that video and they're just going to be like oh he got the idea but you know the title and thumbnail are the exact same okay see how it's circled like this right if you look up here it's circled here and he literally says right here i'm going to use your title slash thumb for the video so the title high pixel former accidentally exposes himself and now it's Bedwars YouTuber accidentally exposes himself, but he like changed it a little bit so he can claim that as as his own. So I'm not saying that I I own this video at all. I just think it's extremely scummy for him to steal my content like that. Anyway, let me continue uh, scrolling down. So he says, I don't really want to be involved in drama anymore. So don't use me for an example. I'll mention that you know this. All right, don't dedicate the whole video to me. I won't. Okay, blah 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 blah. Pretty much. Yeah. So I wanted to let him know that so he doesn't like freak out over my video where I kind of debunk the fact that he's you know doing that thing but that was like a response video so that's different than like stealing people's content i want to make that clear a response video is kind of like you know you have to take someone else's video and then you you know criticize it right but he is literally with like with the exact same points copying my video like word for word anyway let me continue scrolling down uh so now this is may 19th so this is 19 days from talking to him last and i say Hey, can you ask me before I t you take my video again? Now, I want to pull this up on his channel to figure out exactly what video I'm talking about. All right, so this is where I figured out exactly his strategy, okay? His strategy is he goes to some smaller creator's channel, he goes to the most popular videos, and then he finds the titles and he copies them. And he copies the idea, right? From the, from the smaller creator. March 7th, 2018. And by the way, this is what we were talking about. This is why you shouldn't download hat clients, okay? All right, look at what I'm talking about. Just let me play this video for one second. So if you ever wanted a really good reason not to download a hat client... Okay, I'm talking about FinUp, right? And this is only three days after the event actually occurred, right? But then we all of a sudden get Shotgun Raids here who makes the exact same video, but this time two weeks after I make my video... Yeah, they can actually take them here from wherever they are. Where he basically talks about the same points that I talked about. And if you actually go back to his channel, if you go back to his channel and then yo, 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 sir, go I to videos, I'm going to talk about that in a second, but go to videos, you can see that his thumbnail is literally the exact same tweet that I was talking about. Like, the exact same tweet. So it's FinUp. My Minecraft account was hacked, right? Now, I was talking about a slightly different tweet, but, you know, it's the same general idea. And I actually go in depth here about, like, the cheat and stuff or the, the, the thing. Um, but you can see right here. Uh, now he did give me a small amount of credit here, right? This little tiny thing in the description, video idea credit that just links to my, links to my channel. Now he didn't ask me for this. He didn't ask me for credit at all. He just did it. 
okay? And that's a problem. You need to ask someone before you're going to steal their content like this. And then he makes some excuse like, oh, yeah, it's not really your content. He said, it's not really your video. Imagine saying that. Imagine saying that to a smaller content creator. It's not really your video. If credit is given, does that mean that I can just re-upload, you know, PewDiePie videos and claim that it's mine? Okay, yeah, it's not a one-to-one -one comparison, right? I can't get him on copyright, obviously. He did make his own video, right? But it's still scummy, and that's the point I'm trying to put across, right? He didn't copy my video entirely, but it's still scummy that he took the idea, and it was my original idea, and then he uploads it without with barely giving me any credit and I know I could check social blade for that shout out and I could I can definitely see that 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 shout out quote unquote shout out in the description barely gave me any subs so he basically just steals my video ideas without giving me any credit but we've gone over this already so we're going to continue to read some of these dms yeah but anyway let's continue with these dms so he said I mean like it's not really seal stealing and I said yes it is you should ask and he said I'll ask you next time I'm just saying you're not entitled to it and I said yes I am I made the video He's like, you're acting like I downloaded your video. No, I'm very clear about this. I know that he didn't steal my video word for word, but he still stole my original concept of the video, which honestly I think is scummy, right? And he said, YouTube is all about throwing around video ideas. Yeah, but it's not about stealing other smaller creators' content and then crediting them in the description when they get nothing out of it. So you just admitted to stealing my video. Nice. I credited you and shouted you. Of course I got the idea from you. MK, but you should just ask next time. That's fine, just ask. And he said, KK. And I said, I'm not, LOL. And then he says, sec. And I said, just ask next time, thanks. D don't do it again without asking. And he said, how old are you, by the way? 18. You're 18, you're telling a 16-year-old, do you want to test me, you won't like it? That's actually not what I said, by the way. I That's kind of like a paraphrase thing of what I said, but I did I did say that I might make a video on him if he does not, if he, or if he continues stealing my content and stuff like that. And then he goes to the, oh, I'm 16 and you're 18, therefore you're wrong. It's literally the same argument. That It's like, it, it just boils down to this. I'm younger, therefore I'm right. Which is not an argument. It's not an argument. Threatening me doesn't make you look good. This is because I threatened to make a video. I threatened to make a video, and I actually deleted it because I didn't want him to take it out of context. And I said, well, credit me next time, bud. I did credit you. Ask before you steal my video. Thank you. And you open your DMs on Twitter for a second. I want to DM you and open your box so I can delete you from here. All right, so right here is our Twitter DMs, which happened right after the Discord DMs. And he said, why are you leaking our DMs? Because I leaked this little section right here where he says, it's not really your video if credit is given. Why are you leaking our DMs? I deleted the tweet I shouldn't have. Right? But you know, you leak your you leak our DMs and then delete the part you basically threaten me. Good job. I didn't threaten you. You're you're 18 and you're telling a 16-year-old, do you want to test me? Do it again and you won't like it. Sounds like threatening to me. I pasted that. No, this is actually not what I said, by the way, but uh, you know, we're just gonna ignore that. I did I I, I basically said I was gonna make a video on him if he continued stealing my content. I'm 16, so because he really has no argument there, right? Because he can't really prove I'm 18 or 16. You said on Discord that you're 18. That's besides besides the point. Look, dude, we don't need beef. Like, I don't care. That's not even the point. Why would you need beef with you? You're clearly trying to instigate, yet he's the one stealing my content without asking me. You like to tweet about someone calling me scared of you for having 40k subs. Okay, this is a joke, by the way, um, and a lot of people know about it. And basically, my ex said that she's not scared of me or my 30k, and it kind of turned into a meme. So I said, I wonder if Shotgun Raids is not scared of me or my 30k. Literally everyone knows about this joke. And I said, dude, that's literally a meme. My ex says she's not scared of me or my 30k. That's what it is. The people who aren't us don't understand. Your tweet is public, and you liking tweets goes to your followers. Uh, most of my audience actually understands it. Very unlikely. <laughs> but as you said, stated, I don't care about beef. Just stop trying to instigate. Okay. Negatively tweeting about me layer layering on top of that. Well then, dude, it was a meme. Instead of DMing me before that, you, you again don't understand. Most of my audience knows about it. The Minecraft audience is young. They really don't. And then I linked him this tweet that got uh, 371 likes. And one of it is, you're not scared of me and my 30k. And he goes... And he goes, that explains a lot, but you don't expect everyone to know. I showed all my friends, and they all saw it negatively. So basically, he's thinking that a meme, which is, you're not scared of me and my 30k, which is like a joke among my fans, is like a threat or something. And in response to that point stance, but yeah, we can end this here. So yeah, pretty much, I didn't really want any more beef with him until he did it again. He did it again, and I want you guys to see this. And it's it, this is just unfortunate, but here we go. Take a look at this. And this time, he didn't do it to me. He did it to a Hypixel helper.
okay? Now, I can't really speak much for the helper. I don't know if he asked the helper before, but based on his actions with me, I'm going to assume that he didn't ask the helper. Now, if this isn't true, then, you know, it's not true, right? I can't really do anything about it. But based on his, you know, the way he just stole my content and then asked me afterwards, kind of, if you could steal my content, right? Uh, he made this video, top five worst situations I've faced as a moderator on Hypixel. Now, if you go to Twitter, okay, people have call, are calling him out on this. So if you go down here, uh, this Redstone homie guy, so credit to him, of course, for this tweet, right? But anyone could have seen this, right? Um, imagine a 200k YouTuber stealing content. Shotgun raids, my biggest mistake in Bedwars. Top five situations I've faced as a moderator on Hypixel. Top five worst situations I've faced as a helper on Hypixel. It's literally the exact same video. I hope you die, KYS versus I hope you die, dot, 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 dot. My biggest mistake on Hypixel, which is the same thing right here. My biggest mistake in Bedwars. It's hacked client thumbnail right here. Uh, and... Yeah, so, like, it, it, it's it's just really, really, really scummy that he's just taking this 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 moderator or helper, Lionhead's content. We're going to go to his channel really quickly so I can show you exactly how bad this, this is. Okay, so this is what Shotgun Raids does. Oh, there's a new content creator out there? Let's go to his channel. Okay, we're on his channel. Now, what do we do next? We go to videos. Oh, my God. Wow, he's growing a lot. Let's see how we can steal his content. Oh, date at its most popular. Oh, top five worst situations I've faced as a helper on Hypixel. Holy crap, that's a million views. Let's replicate the video. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. This is the most, this is the most insane thing ever. We're gonna go to Shotgun Raid's channel right now. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Top five worst situations I've faced as a helper on, a moderator on Hypixel. Okay, okay, now that we stole that guy's content once, let's figure out what his next most popular video is so we can steal his content again. Oh, my biggest mistake on Hypixel? My biggest mistake on Bedwars? Oh, let's see if he even credits him in the description here. Nope, no credit whatsoever. He just credited him in the previous video and not that video. So there's no credit at all in this video. There's none at all, not in, none in the description. He might have mentioned it in the video, but there's none in the description. And as we've already established, that type of credit doesn't actually give people, you know, enough, you know, credit that they actually deserve. And anyway, yeah, so this isn't even touching on him basically promoting cheats. And, you know, a lot of people know that he makes these really clickbaity videos, scaffold bridging in Bedwars. Uh, and uh, let's see what else. Uh, easiest way to mouse abuse in Bedwars, 35 to 100 CPS, right? Proof moonwalk bridge is possible in Bedwars. How to get a thousand CPS in Bedwars. All right, so we're gonna click on one of these videos, okay? Proof moonwalk bridge is possible, right? And he just, the intro right here, we're gonna, we're gonna play this really quickly. You can see that this guy is pretty much moonwalking without like moving side to side or anything, which I've already proved is impossible in a video right there. And by the way, that was like really obvious safe walk. A lot of people messaged me after this video was uploaded to see that like this, 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 this clip right here, like this is super obvious. The way he's moving side to side there, like, look, it's very clear that there's something that's preventing him from going off the block. So he's pretty much uh, encouraging cheaters right here. You can see that this guy is actually, like, clearly cheating. Like, see that right there? The way he's moving side to side, that's actually not possible to do without safe walk. So he's basically promoting cheaters. But I'm not going to spend too much time on this because, you know, he could make the argument that he's just using doing it for the views and this guy was actually cheating and stuff. But, you know, this is impossible. That guy's clearly using safe walk. Anyway, uh, so... To wrap it up, we're going to take a look at Shotgun Raids' channel, and here it is, everyone, Shotgun Raids' channel. Now, which of these videos uh, are someone else's content? All right, so this one is definitely, this one is definitely, uh, let's see, uh, this one definitely is actually because there's a video called Badline Client 2.0 Destroys in Hypixel, and he just changes Hypixel to Bedwars. That's like his entire tactic. He just changes the title a little bit and then doesn't give the guy credit. So this isn't, this isn't, this isn't. Uh, let's see what else is in his content. Uh, this is in his content. Um, yeah, so four of these videos right here out of, let's see, five times uh, six, which is 30. So four out of 30 is not his content. Let's figure out what percentage of these videos is clickbait. Okay, so there's 30 videos here. Uh, this is not actually, this is total clickbait, right? And it's clickbait because it's not even what it is, right? Like the, the title and thumbnail is not actually what it is. 1.8.9, cheat breaker release. A bunch of little kids are gonna click on that without even knowing like what the video is. They're gonna just want the uh, 1.8.9 cheat breaker release, even though uh, cheat breaker is not out for 1.8. So this is clickbait. So that's one out of 30. 
Uh, this is a hacked client in the thumbnail, so that's clickbait. Two out of 30. Uh, this is stolen content. Actually, these both two are stolen content, right? Uh, high pixel crash ends a, a 1,100 bedwars win streak. All right. Well, these I'm not going to really count these as clickbait, right? This isn't really clickbait either, right? Playing bedwars with Cheap Breaker 2.0. Okay, I'm sorry, but Cheap Breaker is not 1.8. Cheap Breaker is not 1.8. So what is he doing in this video that's, that allows Cheap Breaker to be in the thumbnail? Okay, so this is that's clickbait. I got banned for using this client in Bedwars. Yeah, uh, maybe he did get banned. I'm not sure. But it doesn't seem like it, in my opinion. Maybe it, maybe he did, but that seems like clickbait to me. Uh, <laughs> Bedwars update accidentally creates duplication glitch. That's probably correct. Auto-clicking with Badland Client 2.0 in Bedwars. Yeah, so uh, that's he that's clickbait. Uh, killing high pixel in bedwars, which is like kind of like Quig's video. Uh, easiest way to mouse abuse. So pretty much this is all clickbait. Like this, like a lot of the stuff that he's actually making videos on, like this never actually happened. Like five hundred thousand dollar bedwars stream donation. Everyone knows that's fake, right? Like most of this content isn't even real content. It's either just clickbait or someone else's video reinterpreted. Like I don't understand how this guy gets views and subs. Anyway. That's all I have to say. Uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.